I'd like you to give a round of applause to Lord Vader. Lord Vader, may they sit down. Are they allowed to sit down, Lord Vader? You may sit down. Thank you very much. He gets very cross, I, I, I dare not say it. Um, as you can see, we are being blessed with a visit from Darth Vader. This is Darth Vader as he was seen in The Empire Strikes Back. Again, as with the Stormtroopers, Vader evolved throughout the movies. Um, it was different in the prequels, ANH, ESB, and Return of the Jedi, and indeed Rogue One. The, the costume changed. Yeah. Ever so slightly, but it changed for all sorts of different reasons. Um, on the costume here, and Lord Vader doesn't mind, in, the, in A New Hope, the first Star Wars, the underdog here sat over the armour. Once they got to the Empire Strikes Back, they moved that, they wanted to see more of the actual armour and more of that mechanical kind of imposing look. The helmets are very, very similar. Um, but rumour has it, when they came to do Empire Strikes Back, they went to recast the helmet and the little peak on the front broke off. And instead of repairing it, they just, they just made it without. And then from then on, we lost the peak. Um, the, the costume itself is very heavy, it's a full leather suit, as per the original. Very hard, and very hard for the guys to wear. It was very hard for um, Dave Prowse when he was filming in it, moving around, and they had to have very, very many different suits, and very many different people wearing them, including some of the suits that were half glass here, so that when they were fighting, they could see. If they shot at a certain angle, they could actually use it, and not see where pe stunt people could see what they were doing. Uh, the electrics, as you can see, all work on this, actually on the chest box and on the belt box. In A New Hope, the chest box, I believe, doesn't work. The leather cod piece was custom made and again armoured all the way down in a very similar way to most imperial costumes. It has the armour on the shins with the big boots. Um, I'd like to thank Lord Vader for blessing us with his presence today. Thank you, sir. And if somebody could